Is this a birthday girl? Happy birthday, dear Arrow! Yeah. Happy birthday to you! Yeah. Hello! Everybody, it is my daughter's second birthday and I'm filming on my old camera. I will be getting my like actual vlog camera in a couple hours, but I wanted to film the process of how what what the heck is going on. So we were blowing up balloons. We got here early. The, the helium's gone. The helium's gone? Done. Balloon, now balloon celebrations, which is on Montana. Um, they're very, they're pretty, pretty, very expensive, but they might do it for us. I don't know. Cody can say my mom's in there all the time. Um, Party City is also balloon. Balloon. Fire. I mean, I think the balloons are the most important. Okay. I really, it, it's really just about now, like, sitting out to drink some food. Right, okay. We'll get the balloons inside and the watermelon and the food and the Yeah. And stuff like that, okay. So. Okay, well, so. before, they, before you go, let me ask you a question so I can help us out. Okay. We are now one hour out from the party and our helium machine broke. The balloons, we have like five filled. So now I'm rushing to get uh, these balloons blown up. So that was a complete fail. Let's, let's figure this out. I literally have a bag of my balloons here. And the place also said that they're having a helium shortage. So everything's gonna be more pricey <laughs> but my daughter's journey too so it's all good just this next hour is gonna be frantic okay so I'm at the balloon store right now and all of the face animals I have apparently are too heavy to float with helium so we can't use any of them so I'm doing like one big bouquet um, like jungle themes is there anything else I should be getting? Do we have enough at home to do something at the front door or should I also get something made for the front door? It's up to you if you want to stay. I mean, it's going to take 20 minutes. Yeah, they said this is going to take 15, 20 minutes for this one. So, I don't know, maybe just, they don't even have any animal faces here that would work. So, and then doing the two wild, it's $20 a letter, so. That's ridiculous. No, don't do that. Don't do the too wild? Okay. So, um, see if you can get crafty with what we have at home to kind of do something at the front and we'll just do the bouquet in the back. Is there anything else I should grab or are we good? No, I think we're good. I mean, it's so hard not to because it's so cute in there. Yeah, they have so many cute things. <laughs> I know. It's too, but I think we're good. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> Did I plan this correctly? No. Do I suggest buying balloons off Amazon? No, I feel like I need to go through my whole checklist of everything I did to prep for Era's birthday and let you know what did not work out and what did work out because I had a lot of surprises planning this. Okay, <laughs> I don't think you understand how many balloons. <laughs> this is like not safe, but I don't, I don't know what else to do at this point. We're gonna make it. Appalachian sunrise meets my skin. Even with my eyes still closed, I can feel it coming in. Golden, golden. I'll follow only golden, 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 golden things. is the backyard setup. We have this little swimming pool with our water table. And then I have swimming diapers for everyone, some towels, a little sitting area. These little blow up animals are not surviving. This little decor. We have some like arts and crafts table. This giant balloon thing that has already popped. <gasps> Is this a birthday girl? 
You know your two? Friendly here. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. That's a lot of sugar. Oh I was gonna say do a cheer. Alright, I'm out of my drink. Oh, you did, yeah. I'm very happy. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I'm so glad you could make it. The fun has arrived. Only uh, an hour and a half late. Right on time. Mommy's in here. Okay. Oh gosh, I had to. Cute. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Select it on. Yay! Yeah. 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 Wait, we gotta sing. We gotta blow it. Wait, we gotta sing. Oh. Do we have Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. There's Alex here. There's Grandma's here. Yeah. Big, you can have big. <laughs> <laughs> Elephant. She has a little. Lion. She's the, the ladies' room. <laughs> the Hello. It is the next day. It'd be a good time to do like an after second birthday check in because. You saw bits and pieces. I mainly wanted to show like the decor and then small bits of the celebration. But you know, as kids get older and she has more friends, I want to be like really cognizant of what I film. But I do really want to take you through kind of the things that worked and didn't work for a second birthday party, the things I would recommend. I did take you through the whole process of like, me doing like an Amazon haul and talking about what I was doing and then you saw some of the hiccups but I'm gonna go through all the things that I did, purchased, and maybe it will help you plan a toddler's birthday party because I went into it with no experience with party planning especially for a toddler's birthday party and I am assuming a lot of people are, are gonna be in that same position so Let's go through what I recommend and don't. First off were the kids party favors, gift bags, swag bags, whatever you call it. I did not know this was really like a thing for kids birthdays. I don't remember being a kid and getting a gift when I would celebrate someone else's birthday, but I have been to some toddler birthday parties now and everyone's kind of doing it and I think it's really fun for the kids coming and it was a hit. So I do recommend that. We also kept these right by the exit door just so nobody forgot last minute when you're rushing out with a kid who's tired, who's been at a party, maybe had some sugar. It's easy to just zone out and get out, but having it right by the door made it really easy for the kids to last minute. Pick one, up. one thing I do really regret was the balloon arch I thought I was gonna be able to make. We were having a lot of trouble blowing these balloons up. They kept popping. I did some animal balloons. We were having so much trouble, I ended up taking them to a professional balloon party store and they told me that the Mylar animal balloons were too heavy for helium and so it was impossible to fill them to float. I did also get some inflatable animals from Amazon. It came with like a giraffe, an elephant, what was else? Oh, a zebra. These were really cute. I just filled them up with regular air. They really saved my animal themed decor because all of my animal balloons did not work. For the cake, I got these really cute animal toppers. I was so impressed with how cute this looked. I just did a super plain cake. For reference, I did get a nine inch cake and I think all the animals were used. I don't know, I did have help putting stuff together. Thank you to my family who helped me do all this because 
it was a lot. The other food decor item I picked up were these little animal paper things on kind of like toothpicks. Now for the activities I had planned out for the kids. It's my daughter's a summer birthday, so I had everything kind of like water-based-ish. So we had like a little kiddie pool, huge hit. The other water thing I did was a water table, table and we had this right next to the kiddie pool and I think the kiddie pool was such a big hit that the water table wasn't used as much, but it was used and I would recommend it if you wanted something, if you wanted a good activity summer idea, but you didn't want to deal with kids in a kiddie pool because poop in a kiddie pool isn't fun. The other thing we did for the kids that didn't want to get in the water was we had a little toddler table set up with some coloring books and specifically the ones with mess-free magic markers. So they are markers that only write on that particular paper itself. Making sure to not only have the essentials for your toddler, for, you know, swim diapers, towels, snacks, sunscreen, but also having those items for the other kids who are coming just so it's a better, more fun time around. And then I would say just enjoy this time. Have your child enjoy this time. Don't get too stressed out if things go wrong. I promise you kids don't need a lot to have a good and time. You're probably gonna experience a whirlwind of emotions. <laughs> I definitely cried in the morning and then I was really excited and then I was stressed and then I was excited again, then I was having fun. And then once everything kind of calmed down, you kind of get that sense of, wow, I have a child who is a year older. How did that happen? So just be prepared for yourself to, you know, have some time to wind down after and reflect and let yourself feel those emotions because they're all healthy emotions to feel. It's okay to be a little sad that time has passed, but excited that so many more experiences are gonna be had and your child is growing and you're doing an amazing Just job. Thank you for joining me on the past three years because of pregnancy too on this journey and I hope you guys are having an amazing day and I will see you next Monday. Bye! Even with my eyes still closed I can feel it coming in Golden eyes